Here was the kitchen and it was in repair. I was painting the walls. I had taken up the linoleum so it was um, brand new uh, flooring and it was ready for new um, tiles to go down. The bedroom wasn't in disarray at all. Here's the other bedroom. I had removed the bed so that I could paint the walls and I was using it for storage for a minute. Here's the other bedroom. It wasn't in disarray either, but I had moved this bed out and used it in my room. And this room was my office, the outside of the home. May 2nd, 2021, I started working on that home to get it repaired and fixed and ready to live um, comfortably for the winter. And during that period of time, during the summer of this past summer and fall 2021, I worked hard to clean up that home and living in it. I started my business office out of there. Everything was good until they thought that they had to burn me out. Why'd you have to burn me out? Well, we're going to get to that. Is it because I brought it to light about the child molesters and pedophiles in town? Is it because I mentioned about the churches and the oldest graveyard and about the people stealing property in this town? What's it all about? Because everybody knows that United States Postal Service in North Anson was um, frivolously messing with my mail. They know that all kinds of frivolous acts were taking place against me. You all know that it was posted because I have pictures of that too. However, nobody can seem to come to grips and explain or understand why the home got burned the way it did. Why did it even get condemned? Why is it so hard for the Anson town office to release that information? Who really signed that notification? And what did they really tell Philip Dickey? Or did they tell Philip Dickey anything about the reason why they were condemning it? And why did they not tell me that they had the intent to condemn it? Right there alone tells you that it was a frivolous act. So why is it that Somerset doesn't want to do their job or Maine State Police doesn't want to do their job? Why is it that they don't want to investigate their own friends at the Anson Town office? And so that's your answer as to why I have written to the Attorney General intent to sue the state of Maine and everybody involved. Have a great day.